de Salamanca in Spain with Traga Tragaldabas, um, which is a wine that has some age on it, 2016. It's um 100% Rufet, which um we've been in the club before, maybe just a red club. It's um not a grape you'd see very often, but it's pretty common for this region. Um, they're producing biodynamically and um it is yeah, 13% alcohol, so not super high. Uh, honestly, the color, again, you can't really tell because of the light in here, but it's pretty light. Um, but you can tell that it has some age on it just because of the rim variation and some of the coloring. So on the nose, it's um, a big departure from some of the other wines that I put in the club this month. I felt like I was doing like a lot of like light and crunchy and I wanted to do something that was more like smoky and or like almost like masculine uh that's kind of how i would describe it so it's like got some spice to it it's got this um especially uh because it's uh has some age on it, it almost has these like port like notes to it though it's not sweet at all uh, especially on the top and then on the bottom it's like deeper darker fruits like raspberries but not very like ripe ones um maybe like some baking spices oh you know what it's like vanilla i think that's the port thing yeah it's got this like vanilla note to it which is really interesting based on the um the palette yeah and like dark fruits like plums dark cherries there's, there's a lot here um let's try it So very dry. Don't let the notes of me saying it taste like smells like port or um, vanilla fool you. It is like very dry. The tannins I would say are medium, but the body is light, so it makes the tannins have a little bit more pronounced feel to them than they would otherwise, um, which I think makes this really interesting for pairing with foods. I like the idea of it with stuff that doesn't need super strong tannin, but that you would still want some of like this like spicy smokiness there for. I just had beef stroganoff the other day and this would have been really good with that. Um, I like the idea of it with like tagine food, um, like a lamb stew. I think I, what I have here, it was like lamb and um, couscous. And that was really nice. I guess <laughs> it goes with tagine food. Um, stuff like that. Things that have like a lot of spices in it is going to be really nice and or like heavier meats, but that are not like don't need tons of tannin would work really well here. So moving into winter, it's a good one for that. Enjoy. Enjoy.